Hello everyone, Sigma Later here. Welcome back to Resident Evil. Let's get rid of these. Collect the rest of the herbs. And then go see how Rebecca's doing with her practice. She should be done by now. I think. Don't really remember how long it takes her. Usually, usually you just have to go through a couple doors and go back and she's ready. Give me that. This should be green now. Yeah. Rebecca, are you done? Chris! Chris! I think I got it! Take it away, Moistray! Practice makes perfect. It does indeed. What's this? I wish I had more patience for practicing. I really don't. I've got this weird mindset. Whenever I attempt to do anything creative, it has to be perfect immediately. Otherwise, what's the point? Which is the wrong attitude to have. <laughs> Trevor's Diary. November 24th, 1967. Eleven days have passed since arriving on this estate. How did, I, how did I end up like this? A guy in a lab coat brought me a message. A guy in a lab coat brought me a meagre plate of food and said, Sorry to put you through this, but it's for security reasons. That's when it hit me. It all makes sense now. There are only two people that know the secret of this mansion. Suspenser and myself. If they kill me, Suspenser will be the only person that knows the secret. But for what purpose? It doesn't matter now. It's too dangerous here. My family, I hope they are all right. I've decided to escape. Jessica, Lisa, I pray you are safe. November 26th. How could I be so careless? I lost my favourite lighter, the one Jessica gave me for my birthday. Now it's going to be that much harder to escape this dark place. November 13th. The date where my fate was sealed. My aunt was hosp hospitalised just three days before that. Jessica and Lisa said they were going to visit her. I wish I could be there with them. But wait, even as I'm writing, my, my memory is coming back to me more vividly. Just before I passed out, I remember the men in the lab coat said something like, Most likely your family is already... I pray for their safety. November 27th. Somehow I managed to get out of that room. But getting out of this mansion won't be as easy. I have to get past all the, all the booby traps, tiger eyes, gold emblem... I have to try and, rem and remember for my own sake. Oh dear, Trevor. Gold emblem, we'll take that. And then we'll replace it with the wood one. Or bronze, whatever it is. I always assumed it was wood. It's probably bronze. Don't stress yourself too much. Were you all right in there? Yeah. Yeah, she looks very concerned. She's probably wondering what. Probably dreaming about Billy. Did Billy ma make it out of the Art Clay Woods? We don't know. We never hear from him again. Right, 
and we put <coughs> excuse me All right long sword through the head little dagger through the chest yes we will turn the small gear left That's the wrong one. Ah, oh, shit. Right. Small gear, back to the right. Need you there, because that's where you're supposed to be. Turn the large gear to the left. And again. Oh, and that should be it. Yes. Follow the picture. And what do we have here? A key! Engraving of a shield. Right, we have to go back to the chest get some things. Actually before we do that I need to pop out here first and get something else. Gonna need those shotty shells. I mean I could just avoid fighting the big snake. You can just run around and collect everything you need and then go. But I like defeating my enemies. Right, this outside area should be done, yes. Can't really get into the mindset of what it must be like to find yourself in a situation as crappy as this. And it only gets worse. Okay. Shotgun, put you there, take a couple herbs with me. Uh, got a decent amount of shotgun shells. Let's go kill us a big ass snake. I should have saved just in case I die, but never mind. Oh shit, has this guy turned? No. We're fine. He hasn't turned yet. Need it, discard it. Yeah, more shotgun shells. 
Ooh, a decent amount too. Hi, Yon. Poisoned. You done? Yeah, he's done. Oh, run away, you coward. I'm just going to grab this real quick. Oh, bit of clipping there, never mind. Mask without a nose. Well, that went better than expected. It's in the room where we left Richard. You should know this, Rebecca. We've, we've been over this. And we get to play as Rebecca now for a bit. Yay! It may be for a fetch quest, but we still get to play as Rebecca. love the architecture of this mansion. It's so awesome. I love it. I, but the, I love big country estate kind of places as well. Another one of my favourites is um, the house from uh, The Haunting of Hill House. The design of that building is amazing. I don't even know if it's a real house or if it was just like a, a set they used for the show, but I loved it. If it is a real place, I would love to visit there. Let's check on Richard while we're here. We've got time. He's doing all right. Right, let's go find Chris. Well, Rebecca, you do not have... This is not the time. <laughs> now, when we finished Resident Evil Zero, I know you had a lot more items on you than that. In fact, you had an infinite magnum. Where's that gone? You could have been all Dirty Harry up in this bitch. Where's your um, infinite ammo gone in general? Because all items, all weapons were infinite. And all because I had to play through it that mode because I completely screwed myself over in my first attempt. Uh, I should probably put more time and effort into 100%ing zero. I just don't enjoy it as much as I enjoyed the other RE games. And I'm not sure why. There's just something about it that doesn't quite sit well with me. Hey Chris, I'm here. You good? Here we go. How are you feeling? 
doing? What happened? You were bitten by a poisonous snake and fell unconscious. E easy. Uh, uh, oh, my head's killing me. You should be fine, because I gave you a shot of serum. But again, don't do anything... That you wouldn't do? I'll try to remember that. I owe you one. If you've fallen unconscious, aren't you supposed to be, like, uh, monitored for a bit? Oh, thank God I made it in time. Can you heal my wounds? I don't want to use my herbs. Rebecca is looking at you with an anxious expression. All right, I'll leave. Jeez. I know when I'm not wanted. Okay. We are ready to move on and explore outside the mansion. Well, I'm not sure if we'll get to that point in this episode, but we'll see. I'm going to keep the shotgun with me. Ah, oh, bollocks. I'm not going to have enough... Oh, this is the thing with Chris's situation. Right. Drop this lot here. I'm going to have to go around the long way anyway to make sure I've got all the masks and the health I need for this next bit so the door breaks after this which is fine right, let's deal with you Care of these zombie bodies in here. Whoa! You've already turned. You, you, you shit! Can I burn you, or is it too late? You haven't turned. All right, let's burn you. There's more herbs around here. All right, they're all taken care of at least. Let's do this puzzle, open up the gates, get rid of that last small key. We're going to have to do a... A stock up run. Make sure I'm ready because even though it's another crimson head we're dealing with, he's a lot tougher than the other ones. Oh, I didn't read that. Picture of a valiant wearing a bracelet. It's set in yellow stained glass. There's a switch here. Press it. No. Right, it's bracelet, uh, necklace, and crown. The colours for which are right, green crown, purple necklace, orange bracelet. If I remember rightly, it's this one. 
and the other two are this side. Right, crown, you should be green. No, that's wrong. No, I want to turn that off. Must be this one this side then. Bracelet, you should be orange. And then this one, green. Yes, there we go. And we can open this and we won't get attacked by crows. Excellent. It actually doesn't matter. Oh no, it does. I can put the masks in and then come back out. Right, I'll take you with me because I'm going to have to go come around the long way. to mouth at up bloody crows right let's dump these items off collect some herbs oh, this episode is not the end of this episode isn't going to go entirely how I envisioned so we'll probably deal with Trevor in the next episode but let's uh, get organized first that's the key thing right we don't need you anymore okay got all the masks there we'll take one of these Oh, I'm going to guess that this door is now broken. Yeah, now it's broken. So. Oh. Right, let me check. Where am I? I'm here. Right. Oh yeah, I can't go through there yet because I don't have the key. Okay, so the top floor, the areas that I can get to, are basically done. Oh no, or are they? What did I miss in that room with the candles? Apparently I've missed something in there. Hmm. I'm pretty sure I picked everything up. Clearly I haven't, because the room's showing red. Alright, he's not getting up yet. Doesn't matter too much about him, because I shouldn't have to come back here. This is the right... Oh, Jesus, Rebecca. I forgot you were there. Can you stop staring into space, you weirdo? Shouldn't you be looking after Richard? Oh my god. Really, I forgot those. Amateur mistake. Alright. It's fine. This area is cleared. Okay, so the top floor should now be... Yeah. I've done all the areas I can actually get into. Let's head downstairs and do 
the supply run. Rebecca, you better leave before he turns. Because I, I'm not coming back for you. on the first floor. Alright. The one on the left I need the yellow jewel for and I'm not getting that for a while yet. I can't access that room because I don't have the key for it. Hmm. Yes, outside for the herbs. Oh, there's something in the shotgun room I've missed. Okay. Go this way, collect those herbs. What did I miss in the shotgun room? Oh, an ink ribbon. I didn't pick it up, did I? Oh yeah, he, he's still up and about. This room should be clear now because I burnt the last one. Okay, let's quickly grab these herbs. I don't particularly want to fight the dogs. I don't want to waste my shotgun shells on them. Shit. I said I didn't want to waste my shotgun shells on you. Pretty sure he doesn't actually come in, he just runs around like an idiot. There we go. Cool. That should be everything out here. Yes. Let's check the shotgun room. It should be ink ribbons. And then that's it. I've collected everything I can possibly get currently. Okay, we're good. Yes, we're good. The other areas I can't access until later in the game. That's fine. I, I don't think I can, I can go back through that door, can I? Or is it only one-sided? I'll test the theory. Yeah, I can still go through it this side. I just can't come back out. That's fine. What I think I'll do, before we end this episode, to avoid any more of this running around shenanigans, I'll go and put all four masks in. I need the masks. Yeah, we'll go put them in. Oh, I haven't checked you. That's lazy. How am I supposed to know which one you are if I haven't checked you? Ah, the one without eyes. Makes sense now. Right. We'll go around, put the masks in, come back out, get the set, 
collect all the health we need, and then we'll end the episode. Sound good? Yeah, I think that sounds good. And we don't have to go that ah, we don't have to go that far around actually, because I can now just get go through the door in the main hall. Ah, I am a big brain. I hope I haven't screwed myself here. I'm pretty sure the door doesn't shut after you put the mask in. Uh, mask in it only shuts after you approach the chest, uh, the uh, coffin. And the last one. Cool. I haven't screwed myself. But we'll head back, get grab some health, and then we'll draw this episode to a close. So all in all, actually this didn't go all that badly. going quite well. We've got health items for days. <coughs> We've cleared all the rooms that we currently can and I believe I've found all the files thus far. And we're getting a good insight into what happens to the people when they get infected. and uh, suspenses overprotectiveness of his uh, estate. But we already knew that anyway, considering what he did to Marcus. All right, and with to that end, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigmalator, this has been Resident Evil, and I will catch you next time. Take care now.